As air is heated inside your home, it becomes less dense and rises. The heated air expands, increases in pressure, and pushes air through the ceiling and walls. A blower door is a tool you can use to measure how leaky your house is. You can also use state-of-the-art infrared thermography. Once you've identified all the problematic areas, use a safe, expansive foam to seal your top plates and junction boxes. You also want to seal all your electrical penetrations. The area between your bath pan and drywall is one of the leakiest areas in your attic. Make sure you seal around all plumbing penetrations as well. Blues and Type B gas vents need a special sealant due to their high temperature. Recessed lights are also very leaky. Make sure you understand which ones need a cover on them to prevent fires. Now that the air sealing's all finished, the only thing left to do is to blow more insulation in the attic.